Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we are going to be going out here and using the crossbow, trying out the new zeroing. So with this last update, the crossbow got a little bit of a boost and it can zero to 20, 40, and 60 meters, which is pretty awesome. So I thought I'd go out here, see what I could find, and try out this new feature. I am really enjoying these new customizable loadouts. They save me a lot of time, and I have one dedicated to nothing but bow hunting. I've included the crossbow in a few of my loadouts because it's one of my favorite weapons, and I always include different size arrows in case you run up on different kinds of animals, and I also always include the scent protectant because most of the time with bow hunting, you have to sneak up quite a bit. Coming up first, we're out here in New England mountains hunting some whitetail. I absolutely love hunting whitetail over here in New England. I think it is stunning. The fall colors really remind me of back home in Kentucky, and we do have a ton of whitetail back in Kentucky too, so it just really reminds me of home. We ended up dropping this guy at about 70 meters. Right here he is, 73 meters, guys, and we absolutely destroyed him. Heading on over now to Silver Ridge Peaks, and I spot this level 4 pronghorn. This is an animal I still need a diamond of, and I would love a piebald in these as well. I think they look awesome. We absolutely destroyed this guy. Double lung shot at 62 meters. I decided to stay over here on Silver Ridge Peaks for the remainder of the hunts. I ran up on this level 2 turkey, and we did just drop him right there. He was kind of far out. He ended up being 69 meters away, and we got him. I was trying to hunt some elk in their need zones, and I ended up finding this crazy dancing turkey. She is just vibing over there, but luckily right above her was this beautiful level 4 Rocky Mountain elk. And he was lying down, then he spooked a little bit, and I shot him just as quick as I could before he ran off. And we did get him at 50 meters. He's a gold at 404.94. As soon as I shot this bighorn sheep, some more sheep ran over me, so I didn't know if I was going to get to claim him or not, or if they were going to kill me, but I survived. I got to claim him, and there he is. We got a beautiful shot that went straight on through. I ended up running up on this herd of bison, so I wanted to see how many of them I could get down, and one trophy I'm really hoping for in the future is a melanistic bison. I think they look amazing. I already have a leucistic and an albino, but I think it would be really cool if I could get the melanistic and just complete having all the rares for them. So this ended up working out really good. We dropped three of these guys. As you can see, everybody died, which is really cool. On the first one, we did end up getting a spine shot, so we didn't get integrity. And on the second one, we didn't get it either because we got a skull. But finally, on the last one, we did get integrity at 93.45. She is a silver. I've always liked the crossbow, but now I think I like it just a little bit more. Whether you're taking these close-up shots or they're farther away, you can now do that. So I think adding a little distance to it was great. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and as always, thank you so much for watching.